Hello, I'm Jacqueline. Entering the new norm, leaving our house with our mask on is a necessity. The only time we are allowed to take off our mask is when we are dining. Most of the time, we don't know where to keep our masks. So often, we either put them in our pockets, bags or even leaving it on table. It is not advisable because our mask and table has germs. Not keeping them properly could cause cross-contamination. Today, I'm going to share with everyone how to make reusable mask holder from unwanted plastic files or sheets. It is one of the items widely sold on e-commerce ever since COVID-19 pandemic. I hope my sharing today will be of help. And well, let's get started. First, you will need um, an old plastic file or sheet, a ruler, a pen knife, marker, and any cardboard that you can find at home has a cutting mat. Also, you need to prepare a mask to use for marking out the area to cut. Let's start! We will now use the pen knife to cut the old file to get the plastic sheet as we only need one layer. Okay, just one piece. Then you need to clean the plastic sheet by washing with soap and water. I have a clean plastic sheet that has really been washed and dried here. I will use my surgical mask as a, measure, as a form of measurement. So what I'll do is that at the edge of the mask here, I'll place it close to the edge of the plastic. Okay, here and here. I will leave about 0.5 cm at the bottom. So you can just aga-aga, you know, just put like that. This one will be okay. Um, just put here. I'm just going to make a small mark. Okay, and then also at the top, you also need to have another 0.5 cm. Okay, and here you will need to actually align this because we are going to cut this part off. Okay, and then I'm going to draw the line. And this one here also. Okay, like this. So you get any, you actually can make another. Just from, from the same plastic itself, you can actually make another mask holder. So that's really, really, really helpful for using. Okay, then what you do is you're going to cut off the sheet using your pen knife. Just be very careful with your pen knife. Uh, for children, please ensure that your parent is, is around with you. Okay, and also a good way is always to use a longer ruler so you have more leverage. And you need to press down carefully and using your right hand or if you're right-handed, yeah, just very, very slow and sturdy. Cut it across. Okay, so you like take this. Okay, then I'm going to do the other end. So again, the same thing. Apply pressure onto your ruler. Okay, and cut it out. So there, you got it. Okay, so this one I can keep aside. You can use it for later. Okay, what happens to this, this marker lines, you can actually use um, soap and clean it up. Okay, but for the video, I won't be, I, I, can't, I can't clean it for now, but we just use it like this first. Okay? okay, now you see like this, what we're doing is, this is the tricky part. Okay, I want you to fold the mask this way, but I do not want you to fold exactly aligned to the, to the top. Okay, what I need to do is, from this bottom here, give yourself another 0 0.5. You do not have, this time round, we don't have to measure if you feel that it's a bit too uncomfortable for you. Okay, normally what I do is I will just press it down like that. So, you see how I, my second, this one is lower. So, I'm going to press it down this way. Then, I will use my fingers and press it firmly. Okay, you can also use the ruler, you know, to just kind of... Okay, like that. Okay, and here now we are going to the, do the back side. Okay, the back side here also same thing. We are going to press this time right. We're going to align it this way. So we are going to press it down this way. Okay, another trick is to do it this way like that. Okay, so again use your finger. Press it firmly. We want to make a very, very straight line. Okay, there you go. So you have something like this in the middle here. Okay, this is because we want to put our mask like that. 
so it fits in there. Okay, this is how it works. Okay, now like this is very simple, right? Okay, moving on. Now we are going to turn the mask this way, the shorter side, and fold this way. Okay, this time round, we are going to make it 1 cm instead of 0.5 cm. Okay, this is because this part here is where your metal, the metal bridge area, the folding area, okay, it sits nicely. So this one, we are going to do 1 cm. So 1 cm again, you can use your, your ruler to measure just roughly. Okay, make sure it's aligned. Okay, and then press it down. Okay, same thing. Again, use your ruler to... Okay, and then this side here, the back side also, push down this way, like that. Okay, align it, and then you press down. Okay, use your ruler. Yay, we are almost done. Okay, good. So now you can see it's very nice. It's like there's a cross thick here, 1 cm, and this one across here is the 0 0.5 cm. Okay, then here now we're going to cut a triangle here and here. So some of you maybe you are, um, want to be a bit more accurate, you can actually use your ruler and a marker. Okay, measure at least about maybe th about 3 cm. Uh, 2 cm, sorry. 2 cm. Okay, and then here, I won't draw the line, but I think I'm just going to go. So we're going to cut actually from here, this middle part here, all the way down. Not from this one, uh, the top part. Okay, this part here, we're going to cut it down this way, like that. Okay, and this middle part, also we are going to just cut out this part. Okay, nice! Yay! Actually, we are more or less done. Okay, so now you can just fit in your mask, this, and then fold it down this way, because this part, the metal part is to fold. Okay, see? Like this, right? Okay, but before you actually close up, I also would like to teach you how to decorate your mask holder because it makes it look more attractive. Okay, what you can do is, you can actually use sticker gems like I, that I've done here. Or you can find some any old stickers at home and stick on it. This is very helpful because this one already comes in one strip like that. And then I can just decorate from the top. I can also do it at the bottom. Maybe today I'll do it at the bottom. And then like this. Yay, very pretty. Okay, and of course, to finish it off, I will need my mask and insert it in. So I'm going to fold the white sides this way. Put it in. Okay, this is how it works. Okay, the bridge part here and my elastic part of the mask. Okay. Just twist it and close it up. Yay! I'm so happy I get to make more of my mask holder. So this is how it looks like. And you can really just make lots of more. You can use it to make it for your family members and friends and just give them as gifts. You can also just kind of stick stickers or even draw something with markers. You can do some decoration. And I think it will really be a very nice gift for people. During the COVID-19 pandemic, it's important that we practice good personal hygiene habits. Dispose your used tissues and masks into the bin instead of littering. After wearing it out for the whole day, masks contain germs and could contain viruses which could be transmitted to others. We need to be socially responsible and be careful of our actions for the sake of ourselves as well as the people around us. Littering can also attract disease-bearing pests and create stagnant pools of water where mosquitoes breed. Do your part to create a truly clean Singapore. Together, we can be a zero little nation. Thank you for joining me today. Stay safe and take care.